governor of Meghalaya, Tathagata Roy, uh, joining us. Uh, Tathagata Roy ji, at this point, Jagdeep Dhankar has been selected as the NDA candidate for vice president. It's the second highest office in the country. Uh, how would you receive this piece of news? I am very, very happy that a person of such an outstanding nature and a courageous politician who has, who has been discharging his constitutional duties without fear or favor has been rewarded with a promotion. I am sure he will be, he will be elected and his Candidature is a right step, is a, is a very correct step on the part of the BJP parliamentary board. I congratulate him and I'm very happy. Except that a previous partner said I've been losing a good friend in the right moment. But on the whole, I'm very, very happy. Right. You know, at, at this point, while uh, the decision was made, what do you think was running behind the uh, BJP's mind for selecting Dhankar? Uh, we know that he was one of the most active governors in the country, uh, has always made it to the news for locking horns with uh, West Bengal government. Uh, so what really do you think has led to the logic uh, behind selecting him? I know what was the logic. That question we should put to the BJP parliamentary board. And then I can say that it's a very deserving thing that they have given to him. Right. So you say he's, he's absolutely deserving. Could, could you list out his credentials? Uh, a quick word on your take on uh, Jagdeep Dhankar. You know, he's a man who does not mince words, uh, very courageous, has great knowledge of the law. But apart from that, a few skills that you think will benefit if, it, if indeed he is selected to be the vice president. No, I can't comment on why he was selected to be the vice president. All I can say is that it's a, it's a very correct Right, so thank you very much, uh, Mr. Roy. Appreciate you joining us.